Welcome everyone to a modern video with Leyline Binding. Uh, this is the first week of Dominaria United and uh, Leyline Binding already showed up a lot of... Uh, uh, showed up a lot in the modern uh, challenge. Uh, this list comes from uh, Dominic Arvi and he came second um, on uh, Saturday with this deck. Um, the goal is of course to put Glimpse into play, but this is not an 80 card Glimpse. It's more of a mid-range Glimpse deck. You could call this Glimpse Elementals, because you play Coven of Souls, Endurance, Re Reason Reef, and so on. Uh, he was playing with Inata Trium. I decided to cut it for a third Cavern of Souls. I don't think Line Binding needs to be on one mana. I really don't. And uh, with this deck, I often found that uh, I was kind of struggling with fetch land because you're playing with Colony Gardens and, and Cavern, so... The mana base wasn't as as, as amazing as, as you could think. Uh, Cyborder Swinshot Sniper, that's a cool card. That's an additional interaction for a Ragavan deck. Let's go. Yeah, you could play Chancellor. I mean, Chancellor is not just a meme. The seven mana Chancellor card is very good. I really think that Glimpse Elementals is one of the most uh, underexplored deck in the format. Maybe Leyline Binding, I mean obviously that's an additional permanent to flip off of your Glimpse. This deck list really does not go off as, as well. Again, you have 80 cards, so you're gonna... Uh, this deck mostly go off when you flip Omneth. Hmm. Yeah, now, Kredzor, it's not guaranteed that, that this version is better. Honestly, if you check Dominic RB Twitter post, there's actually a discussion going on there, speaking how, you know, it might be just more of just trying new cards and, and also doing well because you're a good player, you know, like the classic combination. Uh, anyway. Uh, white and the green, so I'm missing what? Blue, red, perfect. So this is, this one's gonna get, uh, I just got dry on here. You want to buy Minsk and Boo in Legacy? Uh, if you play that deck, you buy it. If you don't, you don't. I'm not sure what to tell you. Land go. I could have also gone Colony Garden and Steam Vents. I don't know why I didn't think about it. Because I made a mistake. That's the answer. I'm sorry, chat. First play, a mistake. Not bad. Not bad start. Okay, let's get the Just Guy Trium, which, of course, uh, <laughs> she'd have just been a, a Steam Vents after a Colony Garden, but it is what it is. <sighs> Drop. Could have gone this on turn two, this on turn three. But instead... I can't. When it's playing control deck, meaning that uh, Teferi, Teferi is a problem. Also counter spell, so on and so forth. All right, let's start with a Reason Reef. Hopefully I flip lands to it. How many lands we play in this deck? 30? 5. It's a lot. You play counter spell. Alright. Go. And to answer the classic question, why is no cover lands over normal? I guess the bluff. Uh, I spent Quattle. The fairy? Oh yeah, the fairy arrived already. Oh, they don't bust my plant. Cool. Draw. Nice land. I can slam that Omnath here. Very good, of course. I can't play Outburst because of the fairy. Oh, Fury. Hmm. Not bad, not bad. Not bad start. They take up to fear again, up, up to six. 
But then binding only three types now, because I don't have any forest in play. Draw. Uh, they can have the Wandering Emperor. I guess it's fine if they have it. Back to Fairy. Solid Shield. Okay. I think I want to play fish. I'll play big fish here. Resolves, okay. I thought I had a counter, so that's why I didn't uh, want to play fury. Just said deluge. Shark typhoon. Ooh, that trades with wave sifter. That's annoying, that's a bad trade. If Harry gets to seven, then you want to bounce a clue token. Okay. Draw. Bad draw. Draw clue. Hmm. Do I want to cast uh, Omnath here? Yeah, I think so. No, actually, I think I want to crack another clue, huh? Evoke Fury first. I think I'll crack another clue first. So we go Evoke Fury. <laughs> two and two and then attack. Still won't kill the Teferi. They can go like Solitude here, I guess. No, doesn't make any sense. Archmage Charm. Subtlety. Wow. Subtlety. Top. Right. Uh, what now? I can go Fury again, honestly. No, I'll pass. They have two cards in hand. They can cast Kahira and make this into a 4 4. Wow, they bounced the token. Okay. Now Teferi dies to Fury. Hmm. Hmm. You draw Cavern? I'm gonna draw Fury now. A few are on top of my deck. Uh, well, if I want to kick by, I'm just casting Fury here. So I can go Fury Pitch. Oh, Outburst. Fury Pitch Omnath. And then I have Double Outburst. Maybe that's not bad. Double Outburst. I can start with Fury Pitch Omnath. And then I have double outburst. I have three cards in end. I think that's a good plan. Fury, pitch, hope not. Evoke trigger last. Because if this resolve, I can cast an outburst with uh, Fury into play. All right. Actually, though, I think I'm gonna pass because my opponent has the ability to play a sorcery speed this turn, so they can play something like Supreme Verdict. So I'm just passing for now. They fetched. This way, they can't have a double counter. Hmm. But they minus the fairy. That's true. They minus the fairy. 
Hmm. That's okay. I'm gonna still do this in upkeep though. Outburst. Spetta, 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 spetta. I'm gonna float mana. Cascade. Yeah, in upkeep they have to spend mana. That's my second glimpse. Remember, I only play three. One remaining. They play Solitude. Okay. I could glimpse again. Uh, I'd rather not. I reveal. Leyline Binding, Endurance, although Endurance for sure tucks your graveyard. And Leyline Binding exiles a, a shark token. Uh, now I can go off again with an Outburst. It's gonna be my last uh, uh, glimpse. Hmm. Only six permanents now. I think I should, yes. I'm gonna go out burst. Endurance myself. That's true, I should have endurance myself. That was a mistake. I should have definitely endurance myself. All right, so six permanents now. <sighs> Not sure I played this game well. Maybe this Limbs card should not should not really played in this matchup that much. Oh enough. Two to I found no lands, but like a merda. I found the no lands chat. After making a land draw for seven turns in a row, I still rain myself of six lands. I hope you uh, understand that uh, the way this game is going, it's clearly dictated by a lot of inexperience on my side. And uh, that... Uh, uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what's going on right now, but it's not good, I can tell you that. Madonna mia. Mm. Attack. And pass. I don't know about the luck. Obviously, I could have been luckier, sure, but I also could have played this game so many different ways if you think about it. Like, I was not in bad shape, I didn't have to go off twice. Like, I could have just played Fury that turn, I would have been good. I didn't have to go off. I could just cast Fury, kill the Fury, pass, you know? You have to wait for the second glimpse. I don't know, I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe. Cosmetic ending on Teferi, sure. He has subtlety now. Thing is that you have colony that blocks both of my endurances.
Mm, not bad. Mental and pass. Uh, obviously, the subtlety that my opponent has in hand can be uh, cast through the cavern. Yeah, no, Glimpse never played uh, Yorin. Glimpse never played Yorin. Oh, oh, yeah, again, this version has worse Glimpse for sure. Iron cards have Nixara now? Fine. Big Teferi. They don't attack with Shard, that's weird. Draw? Fury. Hmm. I want to give up. I think this loss could have been uh, could have been not a loss. Weird sideboarding. I wish I could have a way to do a full exchange in my main deck sideboard. I guess I'll leave a <laughs> Charlotte's Asian as a morph creature. I can maybe cut Foundation Breaker and have uh, something like this. Three Charlotte's two Glimps. All right, let's go. Must be said that this game started with me playing the wrong land on turn one, so there was a lot of mistakes. Not great. Uh, do I want to fetch anything with a Wooded Foothills? There is no Timur Trium. I'm not doing any, I'm not fetching anything on turn one. Am I fetching anything on turn two? It can be a breeding pool. Can't go wrong with that. Okay, I'll do that. Twitch of Snapper can also be blanked by Yorin. I can also not fetch and just shock myself. I'm playing as control, who cares, right? Yeah. This is a tough loss. I believe that uh, this, this deck is not easy to pick up and play. I'll lead on with an Endurance. I don't want to play Sorcery Speed against the counter spell deck. Playing 4 Cavern also should be mandatory, right? Because you're diluting your deck already to 80. Oh, look, I can fetch away with Batman. I need what? Green, red, green, blue. Green, red, green, blue. Yeah. Green, red, green, blue. Play... Do we play Otawara? No, 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 there's no space for, there's no space for, I think I'm tucking away lands. 
Nice draw mango cazzo. They can still subtle team my Omnad, but uh, at least they can counter it. Blue, white, red, green. Look at the creation. What a draw, Coven of Souls. Again, subtlety, that's okay. But other than that, like, it's coming down again, hopefully. Put it on top, it's too good to be left on bottom. I'm not gonna. Oh, I can still make a lane drop. If I play something like Big Teferi, I can also go Reason Reef Solid next turn. We'll see. My Lilan Binding costs two. I can't go Reason Reef Binding. This is why, I mean, I don't know. Let's see. The Prismatic Ending my Endurance. Okay. I'm only 11 already because I shocked myself of six. Play Omnath. Draw. Draw. Land. Nice mango. What do you do with it? Just play so but I don't wanna play so I don't wanna play an enchantment. I don't want sorry, I don't wanna play an elemental. <laughs> Why did this enchant? I don't wanna play an elemental here. What do I wanna play? The fairy? Think so. Yeah, I can play the fairy. I'm gonna play the elementals when I have the elemental mana. I'm gonna play shardless. Shardless like a two for one, and they'll counter the. I think I can go ahead with shardless. Opponent is most likely going to counter the the glimpse. And this is a two for one. You can be like, why did it, why, what if they didn't counter the glimpse and you got unlucky? Is that a lose? But that's okay. But what if they countered the glimpse? You got a two two for free. A 2-2 for free is not bad. It's like it's controlled, so... It is a... Okay, how's that? A solid shit. Alright. Yep. Three cards in your hand. Finally enough, you left the Mystic Gate on top. It's okay. Don't worry, I made way worse mistakes. Oh, bella pescata di merda. Uh, what if I go Reason Reef Leyline Binding this turn? No, I don't want to go Leyline Binding. I don't want them to balance my Leyline Binding. I can probably just go Solitude on your Solitude here. Or I can go Teferi. No, 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 Teferi, Teferi, no. Maybe DS though. I attack, they block, I attack. They block with Solitude, and then I go to Fairy Bound Subtlety. That's not bad, I think. If they don't block, then I simply go Solitude on your Subtlety. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll play Fairy and Bounce Subtlety, draw a card. Wave Sifter. Do I want to evoke it? Sure. Go. So they have subtle, uh, subtlety in hand, but there's the fear in place, so the subtlety isn't particularly good. Uh, yeah, I mean... I don't know, this game is gonna probably last forever and playing against control, so every match against control lasts forever. 
You don't just uh, sit down with control deck and not expect every match to last one hour. Five mana Teferone, okay. Teferone will be matched with a Leyline Binding. Opponent cannot play the, the Saddle Field. Remember, there's the Fairy Time Reveler. This costs two mana. So, what I do here is play Reason Reef. Play Reason Reef. Uh, where is it? Oh, Endurance. Cool. Hmm. So I'm afraid they have. Uh, I'm afraid they have a uh, Shark Typhoon to kill my Teferi. Maybe I should just pass here. Hmm? This way I can play around Shark Typhoon. Yeah, I'm not playing Leyline Binding. I'm playing instead uh, Endurance. Oh, they don't have Shark Typhoon. Okay. Endurance will draw me a card as well. Uh, okay, they take up the fairy. Binding is flesh anyway. Yeah, that's true. You play your own Teferi. Hmm, now I have to do something. What do I do? I can go Endurance. Yeah, I'll go Endurance. Trigger Reason Reef. You think Binding on his upkeep was the play? Yeah, probably. I'll go Endurance. Yeah, it's very likely that Binding and Upkeep was the play. Alright, let's Endurance who? Me? Me. Yeah, they have, maybe it's, no, they can't have not Caster Mage. Alright, I'll Endurance myself. There's a land that I'll put into play. Uh, okay, you go now. You have to Fairy. You take up. I was like, now that I don't have. Oh, oh Supreme Verdict. Mech Pansa! Thank you for the sub. Welcome, welcome. Turu, 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 turu. Thank you, thank you. Alright, now. Uh, we both have to deal with things main phase now. So I'll play Leyline Binding on Teferi. Thank you, thank you, Mech Pansa. They do have a Teferi Time Raveler, I know. But... And then I play Solitude, or I can crack some clues. Hmm. That can also be a play. That can also be a play. Yeah, I think I'll crack some clues here. Now I can draw. Should I crack some clues or return your in? I mm, guess I'll return your in. Not sure how to play this game. This game is so hard. So hard. Also the timer, it's there. I need to care about it. Okay, they bounce my layline binding. I'm just fetching an F6 in here. They have five cards in here, one of which is a subtlety. They can also tuck my small Teferi if they want to. It's not a bad play. Yep, they do that. Four cards in end. You must went fine, we went three two. Not much, not much, not much or more. Throw with Leyline Binding. Oh no. Teferi Time Reveler? Yeah. And then I can go something like Yorin. I can go something like Subtlety. Yeah, we go Dispute. And that's exactly enough mana. Arc my charm, you perfectly played around the dispute. Good on you. Good on you. 
Go. I feel like both games I've lost, I could have won. You know, the classic feeling, right? That classic feeling of both games I've lost, I could have won. Uh, so if I draw a card, there's a Teferi on top. Opponent goes Yorian on it, it's okay. Sorry, goes Subtlety on it. It's okay, right? Subtlety puts it back on top. <laughs> Those are the whole of the Storm Giants, use a main threat at this point. Five cards. Hello, Zeratul. Yes, yes, we managed to five all in Legacy. The video will be up today on the YouTube channel. Yep, they fire off the hall. Hmm. Interestingly, now the dispute. Wow, actually, now this 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 is great. Now, wow, I'm very glad I. They're on dispute earlier and not now. That's very weird. So white. So they have to go subtlety and I go dispute. Clean. Oh, they evoke. I forgot about that option. Sure. Can you suspend glimpse? Yeah, but it's not good, usually. Top. A chump block. The whole, the, the whole is ward. Yeah, but still, no, it's not bad. Chump block. You have three cards. I have a subtlety on top. Sorry, um, you, you got it, right? Draw. I can go to fairy now. Oh, I guess a bouncing Kahira. Draw. Hmm. Tefiri again. Pass. It's just impossible to erase the fairy, right? It's impossible to erase the fairy, right? Do you know about dispute? No, but one turn I had one mana floating in. So I guess they, they know it now. Does it look bad now? Well, it looks awful. They have a Teferi and two creature land, and I have nothing. The big Teferi, I mean. Not the small Teferi. Prismatic ending one is small Teferi. Babin. And you activate the hold. Babin. Kahira. Okay, much better. Much better that they didn't. Um... Okay, now let's cast uh, Solitude here. Uncounterable, of course. Why not Legacy Content? Well, I played Legacy yesterday. <laughs> Don't have that attitude. Alright, Solitude. Okay, cool. Draw. Three shell sniper. Oh, I didn't see on a chat. Are we back in business here? 
Oh, also they did it in Top Colonnade. Okay. Let's start with uh, Teferi. Okay. Let's shut down the Teferi with my Goblin Archer. Let's, let's, let's leave one of those up. I shoot down the Teferi. Shoot it down. Do I also want to pick up the little I'm buying? No, not the bunny. Uh, do I just stick up? Do I just stick up here? Nah. What if I minus? For no real reasons. Yeah. I minus for no real reasons. Bobnut. And I pass. I don't want to suspend glimpse. Suspending Glimpse is like awkward because the turn that Glimpse gets unsuspended, they might just play a Teferi and you're screwed. Just keep it in hand, I think. Why is the human adventure over? Uh, we finished the league that we started yesterday. It was a 3-2. It's okay. It's going to be on the YouTube channel on Wednesday. Wednesday. Three mana. Four mana. Five mana colonnade. This has reached, by the way. I didn't know that. Uh, I learned it now because it highlighted, but I clicked OK, OK, OK too fast. Because this game is also like a time game. I'm only... Like, this game can easily end up in time. Blue, green, white, reason reach. So I have to play fast as well as... Well, it's a, it's a deadly combination. No one can play both fast and well. It's either one or the other. Omnath. Balle. I could have I could have kept the, 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 the cavern in my hand to make a land drop. Draw two cards. Solitude is good. Omnath is good. I can't attack, right? I can't attack. Do you want to suspend this glimpse? Dai, va bene, suspendiamo lo chat. No, non lo voglio sospendere. My, my, my board set is good. I don't want to suspend it. Go. It was keep a Friday Mark type video. Yes. I have... Uh, I went to my LGS from... <laughs> Adios, board state. Porco cazzo, ho perso tutto. Alright. I'll rebuild it, hopefully. Opponent still has the subtlety in hand, eh? I think. Maybe not. No, actually, they both did it at some point. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Va bene, dai. Chice is on zero, eh? So I can't uh, cast limbs. Another reason why I didn't like to suspend it. They're just, you know. It's not good. Draw. Play Omnath. Uncounterable. Draw. Pass. Draw the Solitudes. What a game. What's the timer? Alright, Chai. I need to play so fast now. I'm just not thinking anymore. Not reading chat anymore. I'll stop all the upkeep stops. I'll remove all the upkeep stops. I'll solicit your colonnato celeste. Should have maybe waited for sec for when they attacked. Oh, it worked. Oh, nice. Quanto mana c'hai? Tre sei. So I still can't attack. I guess that's not true. I have a I've saw each other on the on the hall. Obviously I should have played land. Again, I'm clicking too fast. I removed the stop in my upkeep and forgot about it. So here we are. Ooh, nice. 
Game four, your turn, your turn, opponent. Go, 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 go. Click, 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 click. Click, 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 click. This is only game two and I'm about to win. Fine. All right, let's go. Game three, super quick. We have seven minutes, 13 on the clock. I recently posted a, a video on YouTube where I managed to time out my opponent. This time I am behind though. After this I went flying to fetch. I think I'm gonna start with the steam vents on turn one. Keep on drawing lands, see my puck. I'm mad the fuck I must be nice. It was already pretty bad. Got a breathing pool. Let go. All right, good draw here. Next time I can set up a detail here plus dispute play. I'll cycle the trime, which I didn't play because I wanted to cycle it on turn three. End combat. Ah! Losing so much time. Cycle. Draw. Basta terra. Let's go. Island. Teferi. Dispute. No dispute. Go. Oh, they don't have a land, okay. Draw. Glimpse of tomorrow. Okay, ski fall. What do I do now? I just get back Yorian? Sure. Go. Looks like I just love Yorian. I think so. What was that? Nice, okay. I don't know what that was. Maybe charm. Maybe they have Archmage charm there. Fetch whatever first land comes up in my click. Draw. Fetch forest. Gym. What if I gym twin shield sniper actually? Yeah, let's gym twin shield sniper. And keep up double dispute now. I can blink twin shield sniper. Go. Put in seven cards in end. They evoke solitude and I'm a done. <laughs> oh man, okay, dead. Click, 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 click. Oh, what's that? Dress down. I don't even know if this works. Do they have to sacrifice the thing regardless though, right? Why did I counter it? I was just... They have to sacrifice that thing regardless, don't they? Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know how Magic the Gathering works exactly. I just play. To. Boom. Yeah, that was a punt to dispute it. Whatever. I denied them of a card. Is it good? Probably not. Another solitude there. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I it came up me up because again I have to play fast. Like I'm gaining time here. Arc may charm draw two cards. Ma, keep on countering. The thing is that this dispute gets worse in the late game. So I think when you have the chance of, I mean, if you have two, then okay, you can. Ooh, hold this from giant's good. The what fairy? What's that? Beat the fairy. Solitude. Okay. All right. Two cards in your hand. Boom, big bird, go.
Hmm, their timer became red, chat. My timer, clean. You evoke solitude. Ma come? Mi gioca torno alla terza solitude. They're playing around the third solitude. Judgy. 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 Playing around the third solitude. It's not very nice of you, opponent. That's not very nice of you, opponent. I can't even do like a hand either, because that would make me lose time. Porco cazzo. Can't even hand either, because that made, made me lose time. Plus, now what do I want to hide? I lost. Because they're not going to play around anything. We just fire up the hole. Va bene così, va bene così, andare così. Not suspending glimpse at all? What? I had open solitude. I opened this beauty in case they are cast a solitude. Who would think they would play around it? Who would think that? Spell? Dai, te prego, spell, omnat. Reason Reef, dai, okay, not bad. Let's cast it. Undo stress. Reveal. Leland Binding. Ah, oh, vabbè, dai, not bad. Pass. You have Kahira in end. Okay. Attack. I can go Leyland Binding. Pay the word cost. Does it say no land? Oh, fuck, a merda, it says no land, I didn't know. Uh, that, okay, I take seven. It says no land, chat. Die, die, spell, spell, spell. You are young. You are young. You are young. The very. Va bene. Attack with a reason reef. Bounce, reason reef. Draw a card. Charlotte's agent. Ooh, Charlotte's agent? Let's do it, chat. Let's do it. Shardless. Agent. Cascade. Glimpse. Boom. Elemental. No. Trigger. Okay. Trigger. Okay. Trigger, trigger, trigger. Trigger. So, huh? So, huh? Uh huh? Huh? Oh, huh? Oh, huh? Do, 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 click, click, clock. Click, click, clock. Click, click, clock. Uh huh? Uh huh? Click, 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 clock. Click, click, clock. Go! Go, 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 go! We have another glimpse vogue, yeah? Chase them as sculpture better than all. Okay. We have another glimpse evoke, chat. Sorry, suspended, I mean. I'll probably just have six in next, in next upkeep. Three minutes on the clock, Kaira. Okay. I have three minutes on the clock. This Cassidy Leyline binding keeps hurting me though. Let's go. Boom. Glimpse. Cast. Triggers. Uh, no. Fuck about your triom that I found. Alright. Now I have to click. 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 And I have to click so fast. So fast. So fast. Click. Click, 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 click. And now I'm gonna F6 to skip all my triggers. Because, uh, yeah. There's no way I can one 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 each of them. So I'm gonna just have to skip all my triggers now. Hope I can click five at some point before all of them resolve. 
Now, now click five. Okay, skip mana. But I uh, got that. Don't. I, I'm just. I'm just passing here. Go. Okay, land. I have two minutes on the clock. I think there should be plenty to attack. I mean, this was not easy to play fast, I have to say. What's that, Supreme Verdict? Va bene. Anything else? Hello, mule, va bene. You got a winner, chat. You have a winner. You have a winner. Whew. No way, I'm not, I'm not a click. Mamma mia. Click. Well clicked. Oh, why blue eye control exists? Every time I get blue eye control, it's the first round of the match. You know, the time we're both red all the time. Oh, mamma mia. A couple of a couple of glimpses is all you need. Just a couple of. They had. Because the thing is that they have Teferi, they have, like, you don't want to draw the Cascade spells, but maybe a little bit of them was good. How did this match last? Forever. Forever. I started this match yesterday. No, I mean, it was just, you know, one, a classic one full hour. According to my Streamlabs recording, I've been streaming this deck for 54 minutes. So, at least 50 minutes. Ooh! Vamos! Sir Snow. Sir Snow, do you play any control deck? Do, 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 do. Who's that? Roy93! Eladamari into Traverse. Hmm. Sure, you could try that. I've never tried it. Yeah, you could do that. Oh, we're right, playing against Gobbos. Gobbles, I got Fury. I got the Fury inside my bone. Go. Yeah, exactly, Auto Slam, yeah. The first first leak today was humans. I didn't do that, no. I I, I think all I'm recall is still better. Blue, red. Mog, War, Maresciallo, va bene. Forest, wait, sift through. Go. F six. Fury, fury. Okay, they can't pay the echo because they have two covered. Yeah, I might put a little binding, but. Honestly, I haven't really played that much Vivian combo. It's way too many formats to follow. I don't know how I could do it in the past, also with standard and all the arena formats in the mix. I also playing draft. Man. I really like Leyline Binding. Well, to be honest with you, so far it hasn't been great. Rundveld Horde Masta. The Masta. The Master Pasta. Oh, do, I, do I kill the Master Pasta? Yeah, right? Nah, I just go Lily and Binding on it. Hmm. 
<laughs> Endurance is very strong. I'll, I'll just go land go for now. Oh, actually, I can't do stomping ground. Hmm. Leland Binding in blue eye control. Maybe, sure. Yeah. Domain Zoo, wherever you want to put it. This card will be fine, right? I think I'm going to go Leland Binding on the Ruined Belt Lord Master. Pumana Ring Lida. The leader of the rings. What do you flip? Oh, uh, Madonna. Matron into Slingang. E poi mandi tutti. Bidu bim. Va bene. Alright, so what I can do here is simply endurance and then solitude on the on the on the rune belt or master. Yes. So I'll uh, fetch. I have to get a green land, so that will be a, a breeding pool or temple garden. A uh, temple garden. Yeah. Yes. So I'll play endurance. Uh, do we have to touch any graveyard? No. Back easy. And I block the ring leader. Okay, and then I also want to slide you this. Uh, what do I pitch? I think I'm pitching the Leyland Binding here. So that I don't get my opponent the ability to flip their thing as well as I prevent uh, a lot of damage. Three damage. Which definitely matters. Okay, so there are 12. They have an Ether Vial on Matron, remember? Draw. Leyland Binding, okay. Do I attack with this? No. I'll just play Omnath here. And pass. Nice. So they can go Matron end of turn. I guess they can find the, the one that deals damage. This is an important match because the Goblin's deck is like a deck that's raising up a lot of eyebrows lately. And honestly, the, the biggest issue is always how do they fare against the Fury and Solitude. And this deck plays four Fury, four Solitude. So, where's Matron Art? This is the 7th edition Matron Art. I had this in my Apopher Cube, the 7th edition Matron. Yeah, they got Munition Expert. The Humans list, we went 3-2. Three, three, hmm. Vile goes to 4. Vile is Ling Gang. And I can kill my Omnath. Pasha Lick Mons kills me. I died to Pashalik Mons here. If opponent tutored up Pashalik Mons, I would have died. Nice. I didn't even think about that. Uh, putana. Impressive opponent. Alla 8 di mazzo 4 pezzi, ma mi spari a 5, ok. I'm dead. Let's clap. I have another sling gang in hand, so I lose. Wow. Could have played this better, maybe? Maybe. Maybe I could. I even played that Sajid early. Wow. Good on you, opponent. Alright, I'll snipe. Uh, I can cut the, the fairies. So they have Chalice of the Void in their deck. I have Leland Binding for it. 
Do I need uh, maybe Endurance can go out and I leave into Fairy? I guess Foundation Breaker can kill also the um, the Chugs and the Vile. Yeah. Okay. La 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 Is a study caster. Yeah. Yeah, that's an answer. We have for double uh, double evoke uh, channel. Evoking channel. Bonecrusher Giant used to see playing uh, Glimpse decks. That was definitely before um, Time Twitch Sniper, which is an instant way of killing Teferi, uh, as well as um, a fine card to blink. Remember the days when uh, modern leagues took two hours each. Back in the Ragavan days. All right, Sears, no. Let's begin. Yeah, Ragavan. Definitely seeing a break now, Ragavan. It's no less than 30 ticks of Magic Online. All this is playing very few archetypes in modern. Chalice on zero to begin. It's annoying. But that's okay, my hand can definitely fire Chalice. Nice, that's how I can fight Chalice. I think I'm suspending Glimpse, right? Yeah. Snapping Ground Secret Foundry, what do I want? Uh, I think Secret Foundry. Hmm, actually I have Endurance in my deck. Alright, I'll go Snapping Ground. Suspend. Your turn. Finishing matches quickly is great. Um, is a great. It's a very positive thing of a format. Whenever I think talk about a format, if it's fast, that's a good adjective for me. For a format. In fact, Popper used to be like the slowest format ever. A lot of people were actually driven away from it. Now it's like fast. Now it's reasonably paced. And Modern has become a format that used to be fast and now it's way slower with the four color decks around. Suspend Glimpse looks risky. Well, I had Leyline Binding for a Chalice, so. I'm gonna have at least five permanents, right? Six permanents, actually. Because one of them is binding on uh, on the chalice. <laughs> All right, Sebastian. Twenty three months. That's almost two years. So much support. Thank you. Thank you, Sebastian. I. 
Very much appreciate. All right, they got his noob. Uh, I'm going binding on Chalice here. Yeah, yeah. Not just the initiative, but also the um, Monster Swift Spear. Made Popper faster. Cat. Blue. No, Madonna mia. Um, oh, white. Green, red, blue. Bob Nut. Go. Go. La la la. La la la. La la. Man's good. Maybe this glimpse will be bad. We'll see. They put into place Noop. With Blood Crypt on top. And they play a ringleader. Kowalski19. Hello, Mr. Streamer. Hello, hello, Kowalski. Are you having a good day? Oh, wow. They revealed Magus of the Moon. Scary. Scary, scary, scary. All right. Float mana here, shall we? Thank you, thank you, Kowalski. Uh, glimpse. Let's go. Let's go. What do we flip? On the trois. Boom, boom, boom. Zero lands, a classic. But that's okay, right? I mean, ah, okay, it's okay. I have Omnath and Fetchland. Allora, uh, cosa facciamo first? Leyline binding on Vile. Leyline Binding on Chalice. Fury on uh, this things. Solitude on this thing. Bene così. Not bad. <laughs> I completely obliterate all you got. I have nothing to do, so I'll click OK. Now, I can also play Omnath if I want. Sorry, I meant Fury if I want but I don't want. Was the new expensive upper cards worth the ticks? I've never tried it yet. I only bought it because I was afraid it would go even up, but it went lower actually, so it was better if I didn't. And I pass. I want to hold this fetch land for when I want to arcast one of these. Chris Botello, hello. How's the standard games going? I watched you a little bit when I was making breakfast. Making breakfast. When I was having breakfast, I was not making much. Hello, Chris. Allora, is my opponent dead? Probably soon. Pretty funny that we glimpsed into no lands and we're like easily winning. La solitudine. Exiling rule the horde muster. Okay. I don't want to lose game three. This matchup die. Come on, we 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 must win this matchup. Mango, mango, focus. Mango, focus. Don't lose, okay? Cruelty of Gix is a pretty fun magic card. I've added to my vintage cube. Cruelty of Gix, because at the pre-release, I don't know if you saw my pictures when I opened Liliana Jaya and Double Unbeatable Rare. I actually lost one match to the Cruelty of Gix. My opponent simply played that card on turn 5, discarded my best card, tutored up their best card, and then reanimated a creature. I was like, what? It was, it was, yeah, probably the best, the best rare in the set. Have I seen any dredge recently? Never. Since they printed Endurance, the number of dredge went down. Do you think a Bob Sleeper is going to play C, play outside of standard? Maybe Pioneer, sure. I mean, maybe. Could be. Have you tested New Goblin Lord in Modern? I have not. But my opponent has. Look at them. Look at them. Our Laura. Check out that my opponent plays with uh, 
Magus of the Moon in their deck, eh? I'll do a Fury. Mm. Maybe maybe she didn't care about it, Magus of the Moon that much. What did you reveal? Nothing yet. Bicock Cat Runeveld Ordmaster. Thought sees. Alright. I don't have any more Fury. Hmm. How do I play around uh, the Magus the best? Maybe with Island Forest. Maybe planes. What did you play earlier this morning? Uh, humans. Modern humans. 3 2, medium. Yeah. I'm a little bit afraid that I have to start playing modern again since the next uh, RCQ season will be standard. Did I say modern? I meant to say standard. I'm afraid I have to play standard again. At the same time, though, I'll, I'll, I'm definitely following standard, even though I don't play it. Okay, I'm not gonna fetch here. Uh, I wanna see if they have a. Bella Piscata. Now I can play around uh, uh, Magus of the Moon perfectly by going Item Plains, Forest, and then at the Mountains. Buongiorno, Squeezy. Welcome. Va bene. You have more two drops where they come from, huh? You do. You do. Uh, I think I, I think I'm getting all my. Aspettate. Maybe I shouldn't get all the basics. Yeah, maybe I just get uh, just get Trium. Planes, and then I go, hold on, Planes Island, I need Planes and Island, so I go, uh, this one goes Planes, end of turn, yeah, I'm thinning, deck thinning over here, uh, this one goes Planes, this one goes Island, this one can go like Steam Vents then, alright, uh, just get Triumph then, yeah, just get Triumph then, see, and now I can cast Endurance though, Parka Merda, I thought for like 20 seconds and I still break, alright, uh, I go island, you are in that back. Yep, that's what I'm doing. Yep. Island, you are in that back. Okay, and now we're playing around Magus of the Moon perfectly. I couldn't, I can't cast Omenath. Maybe it was better if this one cat, if this one was like a green red. Yeah, this should have probably been a green red. Can speak with Snoop. Okay, hope I don't die this turn, but I could definitely die this turn. Bogger Harbinger kills me. Not much I could do about it. Chalice on top. We're dead. Ed's clap to the goblins. Goblins wins again, chat. Let me show the screenshot to a friend of mine that only plays goblins in modern. He's going to be happy to see the screenshot of my opponent killing me. For those of you who don't know how the combo kill works, you put on top Kiki Jiggy and you boom, bada boom, 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 the opponent. Kiki Jiggy can speak with Snoop. That's a game. Congrats, opponent. You win. I had Fury. Also, Fury wouldn't have done anything because my opponent uh, killed me on the end of turn. Yeah, it was just an impressive thing if I saw you sure that's good but if I didn't then it's bad um uh, Amrical the version with Amrical of course has more solages so it's better suited I guess this list has Leyline binding which is another instant Sima Rizu on the play go keep Keep, 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 keep. I'll go Steam Vents, Cavern, Wave Sifter, Forest Endurance, Outburst. I think Goblins was already a good deck. If you remember, I've played Goblins before the new set, uh, recently actually, and uh, I was surprised. It was a good deck. I hope this is Blue Red Merktide. This deck should crush Blue Red Merktide. This deck should crush Blue Red Merktide. Just like uh, most uh, Endurance Teferi decks. This also has Cavern of Souls. 
Delta Polluto. Ok. Hmm, Colony Garden. Do we want to just go Colony Garden? Why not, right? I go Carney Garden crack a clue, I think. I don't need to play Endurance. I have no spells. If you want to start bolting my plants, I'm I'm okay with that. Yeah, that's like that's what they're doing. I can go bolt my plant, land Merc die. That's not very impressive though. What do you do there? Petty theft. My plant has been stolen. Opponent grabbed a plant, put it in their, I don't know, thing. Oh, what a beautiful scene, our Ragavan. It's been a while since I've seen you. How long since I've seen a Ragavan on my opponent's side? So long. Over a week, I think. Remember the days of Ragavan every round? Do I just go Endurance? I think so. Do I just go Endurance? I think so. Go. Plan do six damage? Yeah, that's true actually. Glue glue glue. A point I'm gonna show you my mythic rare. It's the most expensive card on Magic Online. It's called the Endurance. Paired with uh, the fifth most expensive card of Magic Online. They make up for a very good pair. No. <laughs> Opponent says, My Ragaman will not die. I respect that. I respect that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna fetch a red green land here and I'll play a wave sifter uncounterable I fetched a green land because this way any land that draw I can cast uh, double reason reef double uh, violent burst I could have also gone reason reef plus leyline binding but I want to keep the leyline binding for merc died I <laughs> trade binding you're talking about Ragavan like it was a Tarmogoyf. That's true. That's true, actually. The meta game changes that quickly, right? Block, 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 block. Then you pass. Draw. Land. Are we going? Are we going, chat? Are we going? I'm going. I don't know you. Violent out first. Now? Why now? Might as well just do it in the rock keep, right? A click clack click clack click 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 clack outburst cascade counter spell okay cascade resolves Bitty beam! Bitty beam! Sorry for the sound, but I think that a glimpse should require sounds. Right? What is a glimpse of tomorrow without all the opaque sounds? I don't know what it is. Alright, let's take out uh, some of the combo part of the deck. Yeah, I think I like the same sideboarding as I did against Blue White Control. I think it was an effective sideboarding.
Is Ryan 6 still worth a lot on MTGO? They just very recently reprinted it. It went down uh, dramatically. I think to 35. Yeah. Magic Arena sounds as good. I remember when you, when the Arcland Phoenix came into play and you would hear... When it comes to Arena, they'll ask me to dub the glimpse. Well, you know that once MTG Melee asked me to do the announcement of uh, pairings are up or stuff like that. They ended up, like, not putting it out, but I did send them an audio of uh, Magic Flares, pairings are posted or things like that. That... If if it came out, it would have been fun. Instead, they just have the the the, the pre-recorded voice or whatever. All right, you're in. Lands and spells. Never mulliganed in my life before. Actually, I have. It's a very good land because I go try land into forest into cover. Oh, Ragaban. Oh no. You hope they'll have Ragavan on Arena? Oh, wow. Yeah, I mean... Uh, go to Fachamokwa. Just can I try him? I think it's best. Go. What did you do? Oh, you did? Mm, okay. Ragaban, attack me for two. I got an 18. I hope you don't exile the Just Can't Try him. But if you do, that's okay. You exile Glimpse. Alright, one Glimpse remaining. One Glimpse remaining. I'll fetch up the island. They can't suspend glimpse? Nope. We're gonna play Twin Shield Sniper on the on the Ragavan. You see also another reason why you played this instead of Bone Crusher. This is uncomfortable. Ragavan doesn't have dash in historic. Yeah, I can get behind not having dash. Obviously, it would be much weaker, but uh, still good. I'll go Island, it is battle. Boom! Countered this opponent. <laughs> oh, wow, iteration. What a bomb. You exiled another Ragaban. Okay. No lands? No lands? La 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 la. I'll go planes out if they go Blood Moon. I have all my lands shaped up. And then I play the magical Teferino Paperino. I'll bounce the Ragaban because this way, if they want to dash it to kill my Teferi, that's perfect. That means I play a new Teferi, I take it up, and I can't lose. Put a missing all lands. Wow. This matchup is a disaster for them. It's really a combination of the worst nightmare you can think of. It's like elementals plus uh, the, the, the other thing, the, the combo that makes you worry. It's a really, really deadly combination of cards. Uh, Yeah, honestly, I don't really have much to do here. I can just go land go. I don't want to show them that I have this cavern of souls. Do 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 do. Bolt. No, my the fairy. He's dead. Long leave the fairy. Oh, 
Why not Rena six in this build? Mm, that's a good question. I'll let you answer it by yourself. I'll be, I'll be that kind of streamer now. Uh, I just get a stop and down. Sure. Oh, Chris. Chris giving the answers away. Hmm. Actually, though, I could have considered uh, playing Sasha in my turn for the dress down. I didn't think about dress down. Hmm. I guess if they have dress down. That's a screenshot worthy opponent. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I foresee I foresee a shame concession. What do you think, chat? Is a shame concession coming on? Coming in? Huh? What do you think? <laughs> Block? Block. Block. Oh wow, put a knock conceding. You're the strongest. You are the strongest over there. Hello, Radeva Ragaban. Hey, Yant. You go. I drew another solitude. I must have drawn land after the dress down. Murky boy. Okay. My thing is like only Shriek Maw. Freak mode dot deck. You have Solitude. You have um, Twin Shell Sniper. You have Fury. Every creature I play is it. <laughs> no, I'm a bit case faculty. I guess I can go another subtlety. That'd be fun. That would be fun. Another solid routine. Nope. Nope. Adios, subtle too. Solitude. <laughs> subtle dude. Subtle dude. Plant. You have to sacrifice yourself for the greater good. Okay, draw. Land. Let's go Teferino. Let's go Mystical Disputa. Let's go Shriek Maw. The Maw of the Shriek. And uh, Teferi ticks up. Go. This deck reminds me of Vivian Combo. It has a very good matchup against Merc Tide. It has a main deck combo deck that turns into a mid-range value deck post sideboard. Very similar to Vivian Combo. It's also pretty hard to uh, 
also pretty hard to understand well at the first time, just like the Yuan combo. I think the the way to play this deck is to really, really, very rarely go for the combo. I can even see cutting ardently entirely, honestly. And just play what? What's my next big paper event? The Four Seasons. The best, uh, the best Italian events every three months. It's uh, modern on Saturday, legacy on Sunday. Last time it was so big. This time might even be bigger than that. You know, it there isn't much a clean answer. In modern, there isn't an answer on what to play. There isn't. Every deck has its strength and its weakness. Its source is always in the same place. Yes, it's in the Bologna, Bologna. A very, very nice town. I've studied there for two years. I've lived there for two years. The only bad thing of Bologna is that uh, you basically can't have any belongings because they will steal them from you. But other than that, if you just come in there with no belongings, just as a 20 years old student, it's great. If you go there with your bicycle, with, I don't know, your watch and things like that, then it's not good. What did I study? Law. I have a law degree up there on the wall. Yorion, lands and spells. Keep. Wave sitter. Pulse Delta goes must mean one more uh, for color deck, which I can only be happy about. Um, since I'm gonna resolve this wave sifter next turn, might as well just play Trium and not cycle. Why is Leyline playable? If streamers are allowed to play cards in early access. Ooh, Watery Grave. I was really hoping it was uh, another Merc died. Hmm. Let's evoke! Ticket. Ticket. Cannot be countered. Streamer privilege. Yes. In exchange of uh, playing with your hand face up so the opponent uh, can evoke Solitude to play around Dispute, you get... Uh, to play with cards earlier. Pass. Pass, pass, pass. Ooh, two watery grave. Is that mill? What deck is that? Oh, Teferino. Hola, Teferino. Como vas? Let's play it. Island. Teferino. <laughs> the two control nightmare, Teferi and Karen. Of course, they can counter this and move on, but that means they don't draw two cards with Archmage Sharp. They play blue black control, maybe? Yeah, that must be that deck. Eighth edition Island. It's usually people from. Uh, People that play, honestly, I've only seen people from Poland play 8th edition Island. Do you think my opponent plays is from Poland? And he's playing TSP Yendra control deck, probably. No, no, they're playing uh, Demir Shadow. Demir Shadow, I think. 
It's not just Canister, also Kowalski. Also Gregor Kowalski played with 8th edition basics. I remember that. Him and Canister both played with 8th edition basics. Uh, niente. I just go land go here. I can go Forest, Leyland Binding, and Krakatoo. Hello, Pantheganone. Enjoy your work day. I hope you can also enjoy this video on YouTube later. Later. Okay, they attack me with the Shadow of the Dead. I think I'm just letting it resolve. I kind of want to just play a Fury next turn. They don't do anything. I'm just cracking to clues here. What you doing? Huh? <gasps> murky, murky. Okay. Then I'll... Hmm. What should I lay line binding here? I spent nothing. I have to fetch first. Fetch a forest and then play lay line binding. Foresta. Uh, let me cast lay line binding for now. Where do I go? The three mana. Sorry, two two cards in and three mana. Martaila. Three cards in and two mana. Counter, target, spell. Hmm, do I want to draw a card or leave the clue token in play? No, I draw. Draw. I think I'd rather just go Fury now. Where do I go, Fury? Merc Tide? Yeah. Fury or Merc Tide? Pass. And uh, if they have anything that damages them, the Fury is still probably going to trade with that Shadow. Oh, run in the lock, my Fury. Okay, that's fine. Just three damage. No big deals. They have two cards in hand. Draw. Shardless Agent. Can I go for double? Yes, I can. All right, let's do it then. Uh, red, colorless, colorless, blue, green, a green. I start with Charles. Let's see what happens. Seven permanents is a lot. I probably would be able to win this game. Obviously, there's the race get break, but it's just very unlikely with seven cards. They play counter spell, uh, resolves. This resolves, and then I play outburst. You have to float mana first if you, because if this resolves, you don't have lands anymore. So you have to float mana first. All right. Uh, what have I found? Uh, that's okay. It's not particularly great, but can't complain. I mean. Clearly winning this game. You also bounce your art and play to go off again. I don't think this is like an important synergy or anything, it's just cute that it happens. Hello, uh, blue black, so I'll have for sure the mystical dispute. Opponent does not have Ragavan, so I don't think I want the twin shell sniper. Uh, what was I cutting? I was cutting the combo. I can cut. Uh, I can cut some of the combo card for sure. Game three, game three, game three against Blue Black Shadow. I have a hand of uh, Cavern of Souls and the spells, so sort of makes it into a very good hand. that nothing wow sure this list used to run for subtlety in the sideboard strange to see none very strange to see none I love subtlety 
I need something in the mental as well. Although maybe Twin Shell Snapper is very good. Hmm, could be. Alright, I'll get my Just Gate Trium. And I'll play this Reason Reef here. Uncountable, of course. Also known as a 3 mana Elvish Visionary. 3 mana Elvish Visionary. Reveal Fury uh, to the end. They do nothing? Ah, doesn't seem great. This Counter Souls card seems pretty good. Yep, yeah, it's not a, it's not a bad card. I have to say, after I played against three matches of uh, Blue Eye Control, Blue Red Merc Tide, and now this deck, this Counter of Souls card is not bad. Draw. I just go Omnath. What do I fetch here? Um, I can fetch for a Boba Buffy and a Wild Defense. I think it's the same. I'm gonna fetch a, I don't know, Island. Yeah. I'll play Omnath, Trigger Reason Reef. Maybe I flip a land, gain four life. Uh, white and red. And I play Omnath. Let's see what I flip. Off of a reason reef. I just don't want to cast this 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 evil card. <gasps> Subtlety. All right. Top. Yep. Cool. I'll take five down to thirteen. Uh, draw the Omnath. I have a fetch land, so next time I can go... I mean, it depends how much money they have left. I'm certainly not casting anything uh, that can be countered, so... Oh, two shadow? I uh, put an intent. I think you're gonna hate to see this. I think you're going to hate to see this. I guess they could have uh, a... Dress down... Hmm. They could have addressed down. Because I can go Solitude here. I think I'm going Fury first. And if they go Dress down, I can respawn with something. The two cards in the end. Dress down also makes these. Okay, I'll go two and two. Again, I could have saw you this Merc die to make them gain five life and kill both of the shadows. Uh, that's obviously a great play. It's just that uh, this way, if my opponent played Dress Down, I could have responded, so I should pitch Omnath and kill your things against Dress Down. And the Fury still would be into play. Okay? It would have been great for clickbait and for a clip, but I don't think it was a good play, unfortunately. Sometimes, uh, sometimes it's better to do less flashy play, less flashy play, and actually they discard my solitude. I can actually lose this game now. I don't want to cast anything that can be countered, so I'm not gonna evoke solitude here. Opponent an exiled earlier uh, Merc died, I think. So I got an eight. How do they answer my fury, I wonder? They don't and go to one. Looks like they don't and go to one. Alright. Do I own that? Red. Green, white. If I flip a land off of Reason Reef, I win the game. 
because they trigger the third chapter of Omer. Run in the lock. They knew I have this beauty in end, but I am casting it regardless. All right, let's see. Draw card first. Flip. Lend. Very nice. So, first chapter. Second chapter. Third chapter. And you lose. All right. It's a pretty... Pretty easy win here. The yeah, only loss was against Goblins. Which can't really be that bad of a matchup. I think that this deck, honestly speaking, like, honestly speaking, I can't see the bad matchups right now. Like, it, this deck crushes Murktide, Grixis Shadow, whatever blue or Ragavan iteration decks you want to try against. It, I guess, L Living End? Must be a bad against leading end. You have four Tefiri, four Endurance, but you have an 80 card deck. No, I think Goblins must be a good deck. Like, sorry, good matchup. But you have these effects. What about Vivian Combo? So the thing with Vivian Combo is that it's still like a, a very good matchup against uh, Blurred Merc, Tide, and Shadow. But maybe this is just way better. Like, like this deck has Cavern of Souls. And granted, I very hardly lose to 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 Merc Tide with with Vivian Combo, or again, used to. I haven't played that deck in a while. Having three, but honestly, I would play four Cavern of Souls. Just means that if you play against the deck with Counterspelling it, it's just too good. Against Rakdos Scam, four color used to be good against Rakdos Scam. Four color used to be good against Rakdos Scam. I definitely want to explore more of this archetype. Uh, maybe we can go back to the 60 card version. And the reason why no force of negation? It's just, mm, yeah, I mean, it doesn't, it's not a great card. That's my reason for force of negation. I just don't think it's a very good card. Uh, keep. Bottom. The bottom line binding, I think so. Maybe this card is not very good in modern. I don't know. Oh, and I just Nice, 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 nice. I just got Triumph Forest. Pure combo beat this deck. Yes, that's true, but at the same time, this deck also has the explosiveness of a, a turn four glimpse, maybe. Yeah, pure combo beat this deck, I know. Honestly, the best. Best that could be still like a proactive combo deck that you know to pilot well. Like, I don't know, I'm gonna Titan, Arden Scales, those type of decks. If you know them well, you have probably like zero bad matchups. Uh, do I go for Wave Sifter? Yeah. Thank you to Odds Il Mediocre. Odds Il Mediocre. Thank you, thank you for the Prime sub. Appreciate it. More shutters. Am I going off here? Am I going off here? I might. It depends if they have a land for stealth here or not.
Yeah, exactly. I can evoke Saji and get an extra permanent. They don't have a land. Very nice. Yeah, I'm doing that. I am doing that. Let's go solitude pitch. What do we want to pitch? Uh, solitude pitch solitude. Yeah. Solitude pitch solitude. Evoke last. First exile a creature. So you only loot once and then I play out first. YOLO, you only loot once. And now the outburst will count six permanents. Again, this is not as good as the version with Chancellor. Of course. I don't have Chancellor in my deck. That's much worse. What do I have? Alright, not bad. <laughs> not, not complaining. Not complaining. Pepango is not complaining. Alura, I am just, I'm gonna play your in this turn, so I'm gonna get four mana in my pool, I need four more mana. Four mana pool, four, I have to say yes to this. Theory. Four damage there. We should have Sergeant in my hand now, and not Omnath, but okay. Draw. Okay. Four damage. Resolves. Clean stack. Get back your in. And then how do I fetch? I want to deal myself less damage. So I'm going to go Mountain. Mountain. I'm going to go play. I bet part of a penalty on Steam Vents, I think. I guess I can get Island here. I can just, get, I don't have enough basics. Wait, I have enough basics. I can go Forest and then Plains. No, I didn't, I can't cast Omnath. Well, it's unlikely my opponent to unholy heat my Yorin, right? Yeah. I think I just don't want to take damage. No, 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 I don't think I care about damage. I'm going to go Steam Vents. Yes. And uh, Planes here. I'm going Forest. Yeah. And then I play Yorin. And then I kill your Shredder and draw another card. Turn three, chat. This is my turn three. What about your turn three, opponent? Pum. Draw. Blue and binding. Okay. Turn three. Boom. If you don't have Yorin in your deck, though, when you go off with a lot of mana, you don't have a free payoff in the exile zone. You bolt my Fury, and then you play Murky. If you play Murky, I top deck Leyland Binding. That was a good draw. If I didn't top deck Leyland Binding, this 5 5 Merc would have actually held my board state. Do I go for Fury as well? Probably. I'll play Leyline Binding. I'll tap for eight. I guess I don't want to play Fury, no. I'll just pass. I should have played Colony Garden then. I mean, we got, we got we got the best pairings. We got the best pairings for this deck, I think. This should have been a 5-0. Although, I don't think I punted against Goblins. I just ended up to... They just ended up to get very good hands, right? I don't think I punted that much against Goblins. Alright, sideboard. I'm going to bring in my 8. I'm going to take out the usuals. Go. Mm. 
Yorion Excellent hand Turn one Ragavan Might be bad, but again, you can't play prismatic ending in this deck. You have to play Linen Binding If you play four color, you must play Lila, prismatic ending over Linen Binding Because of Ragavan. All right, they don't have Ragavan Okay, now we have to think about Blood Moon That's the main concern now this hand doesn't have the best mana base to play around Blood Moon. I guess I can just let the Blood Moon resolve and then Prism and then Lilian bind in it with, with an island. Yeah. Could do that, right? Tipo, I can go Breeding Pool here. Yeah. All right, so yeah. I'll go Breeding Pool there so that they can counter a turn three. Um, a turn three, come se chiama? Um, iteration. So I'll go for a breeding pool. My opponent showed me his RC, give me two. Give me one, sorry. They, they surveilled in the graveyard. See, now I can go land go. Good draw, very good draw, mamma mia. Quante forte cavern of souls. Land go. I can't actually go secret foundry lid I'm binding if they go. But I can just pick up a planes and let the blood moon resolve. But I think they're gonna cast iteration and just dispute it here. Easy. Nope, I actually don't. Alright, cool. I'm not gonna fetch up anything, I'll just untap. Uh do, you, do I even want to play Cavern of Souls? Must see die. Split Cavern of Souls and Elemental and pass. And now I can fetch up a planes and cast Ma. Nope, I can't. I can't because it costs four if the Blood Moon resolves. There's only planes and, and Mountain. Uh, yeah, perfect. I'll go for this Pute. They can go for a counter fight if they want to. That's okay to me. Uh, still not touching this plot of strand. Stand tapping. You see also like the fear. I'm playing a combo deck, right? So my opponent was afraid of uh, doing anything. That's another great advantage of playing a deck like this. Because otherwise I would have just counter back. And I mean, sure, I top deck the fairy. But if I didn't top deck the fairy, I wouldn't really have a way to punish them tapping out. So they didn't want to tap out, I just let the, the, the expressive go. Playing a combo deck instead of playing four color Omnath, just regular, I think it's a great advantage. I'll pass here, no, no, no reason to do anything for me. I'll fetch up a forest with that, so go forest and planes. But again, I don't need to fetch up now. My mind is just full of removals or answers, whatever. I don't think I need it to deploy. And before casting this endurance, I want them to have a, a little bit more stuff. Or like attacking me with the, the channeler, for example. Good evening, testify. How's Leila and Bianden been? It's fine. It's fine. It's been fine. I wouldn't say it's been like you know, game changing or anything, it's just a removal spell. That you can cast this deck cascade, you know. I have both endurance and the land binding up. A second Darcy. 
Let's see if they attack. If they do, I'll go for an endurance here. Tuck your graveyard and then block. I would board out uh, Darcy against it with endurance. Uh, you play a lining bolt. Okay. Four cards in your hand. Draw. Another endurance. Very good draw. Uh, yeah. Uh, do I want to pick up Yorian? Hmm. Yeah. Why not, right? I can go planes, pick up Yorian. Then I can go forest. I can go forest endurance. Again, the matchup is so good that one of the very few ways you can lose is uh, uh, to a Blood Moon. Like once there isn't a Ragavan down, the only way you can lose against Murktide is to Blood Moon here. They can make a four full Murktide. And it's actually possible here, so I'm gonna just endurance. I'm not gonna ambush them. So just fetch up in a way where, and I guess Lady like, Binding now also protects you from the Blood Moon death. So yeah, we just keep care of uh, Merc Tide, that it doesn't come down, and again, uh, it's just unlikely that they will attack again, I think. So I didn't go Blood Moon, but we are ready to fight it. Ragavan, okay, four cards. Yeah, yeah, that was a fetch Merc Tide. That was a fetch Merc Tide play. Dispute. Attack. Attack and then it goes all to kill right away. I mean, my hand is just invisible. More Merc Tides. I'll go for a Solitude. Let's see how it goes. Cast. White. It must be said that I have drawn uh, a lot of Cavern of Souls in these matches. Maybe if you don't draw Cavern of Souls, the matchup is nearly, is not nearly as good. Yep, okay, they have an only heat. Mm -hmm. I'll take one. I've dispute for express iteration. They don't play. Okay. I can go your in dispute here. Not a bad idea. You're in dispute is not a bad idea. Click, 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 click. I can go counter spell. I go dispute. It can go double counter spell. Uh, yeah, then it works. I'll go dispute. Could have maybe led on Teferi. Because this way they can dispute my dispute or your in, and I can't pay. Yep, second counter spell. Well, point I got Delirium. I'm not going to use any of these Leyline bindings. Because I need them to kill the Merc Tide.
If they dash Ragavan though, I will play Leyla Binding. I go to 13. We need to fear balance the Merc Tide instead. Yep. Yep, that too. Yeah, that's a Merc Tide. That's fine. Two cards in it. Do I want to go binding gear? Mm, no, no, I don't. I'll just lead on Teferi first. I'll lead on Teferi first and then we'll see how to proceed. I've already played two counter spell. If this resolves, then I am just okay. No, I'm just bouncing Mark Tide. Clean shield sniper. Hmm. I also played clean shield sniper. Shot this and attack. That's okay, total control. <laughs> okay, there go Shredder. Did they, have, uh, did they already play two spells? So this one's one triggered at three card. I think I'll go on uh, the binding now. And then I'll play Wave Sifter. Attack for five. Good game, good game. Yeah, boarding of the combo has worked wonders so far. Uh, we haven't played against any of the more aggressive decks where you, or like the fast decks where you need to combo. Like Living Gander Rhinos, maybe those are matchups where you need a combo, I don't know. What did you bounce? A plant? Really? Okay, so that's not, better, not much better to do. All right, did you? What's the time? Okay. All right. Thank you for watching this video. This deck definitely uh, very good against counter spell decks. Definitely very good against counter spell decks.